Hi, I'm Ryan. And I'm Jimmy. We are Picture This, and you are watching the Buzz Artist Spotlight. Take my hand, and we can go walking, and we can talk about whatever is on your mind. Be my friend, but secretly like me. I want to catch you staring and make you go alright I love the way your hair falls in the summer I'll treat you like... Um, it started in the town of Atai with Ryan posting a song on Facebook uh, me seeing the song and saying can you come up to my studio and record it and when we did it was class we got on very well with it and we said let's make a band oh, Is that everything? Yeah that was the whole kind of thing, but it kind of happened in a day or two. <laughs> uh, no, it was Take My Hand, it was the first one we recorded, yeah. It just We put it up online and then the reaction it got kind of forced us into being a band. It was like, well, we can't just leave that now and never go back there, because a lot of people, we just kind of got fans straight away. It just like went The song went viral on Facebook and then we just, yeah, we were forced into the band straight away from Take My Hand. Yeah. Yeah, we just lot, wrote um, lots more songs that were like Take My Hand, big anthemic songs and... Um, we didn't actually gig till like six months after the band formed and then we play live with our two best friends who are from a Thai um, because they are big anthemic songs it's not suitable for us to just sit there with two acoustic guitars when we're playing live um, so our two best friends play with us and yeah just really the songs just kept getting bigger and bigger and then we wanted to go on and uh, perform them live and we sold out our first ever show was to 800 people so um, we got Republic's notice through a guy in Republic Chris Tekka who saw us online, I just saw the band name, listened to the song and was just like, yeah, let's do it, and got in touch with our manager. We were going to New York to put on a showcase gig, um, just to meet people and stuff, and we were doing a show with some with an Irish company, and we just, that was it kind of, they saw us play, and the next day they were like, let's do it, and we just said, okay. You guys would take long to make the right? No, we, <laughs> we act on, we act on a kind of first, first time, meetings and stuff so it's worked so far yeah it has worked the title it's self-titled it's picture this ep um we d it, we didn't even record it as an ep it was just a, a collection of songs that we had over time we recorded like 20 songs and then just from hanging out after we wrote take my hand and then we we're like let's bring out an ep jimmy looked on his laptop at the 20 songs we picked five of them that fit perfectly together and that's the ep um writing no because all them songs were written at home in my bedroom and recorded the demos in Jimmy's studio so we actually went into the studio with all the songs already written um, they just had to be recorded but it was a different dynamic um, in terms of recording because we were in Blackboard Studios in Nashville which is one of the most famous studios in the world where usually we're in Jimmy's shed so uh, that was pretty cool yeah anything you want to add to that? Um, it, it's just it kind of puts things under the microscope a lot more when you're when you're, when you're concentrating on the song only and there's nothing else going on usually when we're at home you know, it's kind of a, you're in your bedroom and, you know, you can get distracted so easily, but there, it's very, you concentrate a lot and you, you make real decisions, especially with a producer. You know, we were working with Shakir King and when he's there and he's he's keeping you on your toes, you can get a lot more, uh, you can get a lot more out of it, you know, and the songs become better because of that. As I said, I only ever recorded with Jimmy in his house, so it was a culture shock, but they made us very at ease, but I think it was definitely the right thing to uh, record our debut album properly away I think in terms of a second album we can do whatever we want really let's we could go back to Jimmy's bedroom and do it and that's what we might do who knows are you finished with the album now or is there a little bit more to do or is it completely done it's pretty much completely done there's just a little bit more to do like some just time just fixing little things or but it's all tracked it's all recorded so it's pretty much finished yeah um, we are doing a tour across Ireland and the UK which is sold out it's a big tour for us and then we're playing festivals over the summer. Um, we are playing a festival in Toronto as well, I know, which is in the States, but we're coming back over to North America. Um, but hopefully now when the album comes out, we'll, we'll be doing a, a worldwide tour, which will definitely include the States, so that will be this year. Ireland is very rowdy, and everyone's up on shoulders. And, but that's what we love, because that's what our, our music is about. Um, our music is, although romantic, it's also quite rowdy, and it's quite edgy. And... I am an Irish fan. I am that person at the gig doing that, so why not? But um, yeah, I think in America, the shows we've played in America so far, the, the crowds are very tentative and very 
they're very tuned in they're really really listening to you and they're really like just standing there and they're appreciating the music which they do in Ireland as well but in Ireland they're appreciating it on someone's shoulders whereas in America they're kind of <laughs> standing side by side going wow that was amazing <laughs> Yeah, uh, we always keep in touch with everyone on social media. I think that's very important for us since we started there. And uh, our social media handle is at Band Picture This, and that's for everywhere, like whether it be Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, at Band Picture This, and you can go find us and go tweet us. It's at Jimmy Rainsford and at Ryan Hennessy underscore underscore on Twitter. And we're always on our phones anyway, so you can just tweet us and we'll we'll see it. We will see it. I'm Ryan, and I am Jimmy. We are Picture This and you've just been buzzed.